God in heaven. I need to start getting that shit taken care of before we even start the freaking video. What is good, everybody? Welcome to an Epic My Damn Toys video. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we have some massive hauls from Ringside Collectibles where you can get all of your epic WWE action figures. Use code MDTOYS. I think they have a Cyber Monday 2.0 sale going on. They have a holiday sale going on. They have a bunch of things that are like 80, 70, 60, 50 percent off, I do believe, over there. And you can get some epic things for your WWE Pick Your Collections, guys. And today, I finally received my haul that I picked up from Black Friday. And now they have a Cyber Monday sale, so I'll probably go buy some more. But remember, use promo code MDTOYS to save 10 percent. Helps us out here at the channel. We really, really, really appreciate it. All the people that have been using the codes for Black Friday, Cyber Monday, and just using it for all of your Christmas gifts, your, your Christmas hauls. Uh, we really, really appreciate and I thank you so very much from the bottom of my heart for you guys using that code. I, I, it just means so much to me that you guys would use our code and think of us when you are checking out at Ringside Collectibles, guys. But WrestlingFigures.com, go grab it. But here today, guys, you can see, like, look at my hand right here. This, this box is freaking tall, man. This is a big box right here. I finally got my order. I'm very excited for it. Not only did I get my order, but I also got a new figure from eBay, I think. And I also got a new custom for my Secret Santa custom. I don't know if you guys know what k Secret Santa is. All over on Instagram, every year we get a bunch of customizers together. We do a Secret Santa and we put all the names in a hat. Everybody draws out one name. Everybody makes like a predetermined list of customs they would like to have made. And you go through and somebody, it's randomly selected. They send you who you're supposed to make a custom for. They send you their list and it is up to you to go through the list, pick a custom you want to make, and then everybody makes a custom for someone. And it's like Secret Santa, but custom WWE figures. Really badass idea. I finally got mine and I actually shipped mine to to the person that I'm supposed to make one for like a couple days ago, so they should be getting it soon. I'm very excited for that as well. And we're just gonna shut the hell up. We're gonna show off that secret custom. I'm super excited for it, and we're gonna dive in here. So let's just go ahead and just, just dive in right here, guys. So the first figure I got from Ringside, you know I had to do it. I had to get another Cedric Alexander because they were $12.99, and I had to get another Cedric Alexander because you guys know I love Cedric Alexander, and you can never have too many customs. I'm gonna crack the torso and probably give him a custom attire or something. Something. So I wanted to get another Cedric Alexander. Um, the next figure we got is not from Ringside. This is not from Ringside Collectibles. This is actually from eBay. I got this on eBay. Uh, really cheap price. It was like $10 or something on eBay. So I wanted to grab it. And it's the new Survivor Series Shinsuke Nakamura mock-in packaging. And I think Shinsuke is going to wear this at Hell's Gate. So that is something that I wanted to do. Uh, and I wanted to pick it up. He's rocking the Vindication Blue. So I am going to put this on this man. And he's going to rock this at Vindication. Hell's Gate Elimination Chamber. So we did pick up that Shinsuke Nakamura from eBay. I just went ahead and put it in the box. The next figure that we have, guys, is the Elite 66 Kevin Owens. I think I could see my reflection. Is that my reflection right there? By his hand right there? What a stupid ass. Anyways, got this for the parts. I love this head scan. I love the, the shorter, you know, smaller arms for him. And it's just a beautiful looking guy. I love Kevin Owens, so I went ahead and grabbed one of those. I think that one was like $8 or something, so you can't go wrong with that. And because it was $8, I went ahead and grabbed two of them. So I have two of the brand new, brand new. Brad, this shit came out like in January or February. This ain't new. It's kind of new. Next up, guys, we do have some basics in here. And I went ahead and grabbed this basic Jeff Hardy Basic Series 97 with the SummerSlam on there. It is the purple, white, and black face paint. Looks really good. Always wanted to get this basic to do a head swap on an Elite. So I went ahead and grabbed that since it was like 4 or $5 as well. Um, another basic that we grabbed was the Basic Series 102 Jeff Hardy, and I just really loved this head sculpt, so I wanted to pick it up as well. I think it was really nice. Um, another uh, face paint that I wanted to do a head swap for because, you know, you, you definitely want to convert these into Elites, and this will be a really easy Elite figure conversion. All you got to do is pop it onto the Chase variant Elite 67 figure that I need more of, so... Uh, we are definitely going to be doing that, so we have that. Next up, guys, we do have another basic, and it is the WrestleMania 36. Seth Rollins got this for the head sculpt, obviously. And it looks good, man. I really do enjoy this. And uh, I got this also because I figured I could use these knee pads for something, like a Seth Rollins fix-up or something, and then he'll probably go in the crowd. So I don't know what I paid for this, but I pretty much paid for the knee pads and the head sculpt, and that's okay with me, and then a crowd member. So that all works for me. No, no biggies there. I like this a lot, and I cannot wait to get him out of the packaging. Moving forward, guys, we still got a lot in here. We have uh, a Elite 67 Randall Keith Orton right there, and I wanted to get this for the same reason I got the Cedric 
Patrick and the Kevins is because of customs. You know, you want to make customs, you want to get some stuff going, and I wanted to grab another one of these because I love how the uh, tattoos go up on the torso. You guys know, like, behind the jacket, he has his skull tattoos on the torso for this, so I wanted to do some torso swaps, and uh, that's the reason we got that Randall Keith. Get, get out of here. Next up, guys, we do have another Cedric Alexander figure. So you got, you got, I mean, it's $12.99, Brad. You go ahead and grab another one. No biggie to me. Went ahead and grabbed that hoe. So we got another Cedric for customs. We went ahead and grabbed another ECW ringside exclusive Matt Hardy. I think this figure was legitimately like $4.99 over there. And I could not pass that up. I figured why not add, I almost added two or three to the cart. Because, I mean, the, the $4.99 for an Elite, you might as well. It's a ringside exclusive. Great parts for other figures and Matt Hardy fix up so I thought this was a really excellent deal so I went ahead and grabbed the ECW Matt Hardy another figure guys is the uh, Randy Orton we got two of those so that is the second Elite 67 Randy Orton and then finally guys the last figure we have in the box or figures I should say are the ringside exclusive Hardys went ahead and grabbed another one of these I think they wanted $26.99 for this two pack and it is beautiful so I wanted to grab go ahead and grab this for you know fix ups and different Hardy looks and you know just some different fix ups so this will be my second set of ringside exclusive Hardys. I may even get in a third set. I'm not sure. Just so many fix-ups and different things you can do with these uh, these Hardy boys. And I want to get so many looks that, you know, I, I still have a ton more to get. So, I mean, it, you might as well get them while they're on sale. But that is it. The box is completely empty, guys. So now what we're going to do is we're going to move over to the backstage area and we're going to crack open our custom figure that we got from the Secret Santa, and we're gonna break down what we got. All right, guys, so here is my envelope for my Kayfabe Secret Santa custom, and I'm super excited. I got all the figures lined up back here. Very excited about that haul. I mean, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 total elite figures in this haul here today. So that is an epic little, a little thing there. So in this Secret Santa thing, guys, there are so many talented customizers that it's ridiculous. Like, there are, there are so many good customizers out there on Instagram, and there's so many great customizers that are involved in this project that uh, it, you can't go wrong. It doesn't matter who you get. I think you're going to end up with a badass custom. So let's just go ahead and crack it open. And I think I did see an envelope in here that I've already predeterminedly opened. That way I wouldn't have to sit here and rip it open on camera. But look at this artwork right here. This is freaking phenomenal. It is a Christmas version of our logo right here. And this is this is freaking excellent, man. So whoever drew this, is it's beautiful. You got the MDT in like the, like the it's the zebra print, but it looks like a candy cane and then you have the green on green in the background with the black outline uh really excellent stuff and whoever did this looks it looks great so it looks like an artist did this for sure uh this looks great i need to change my logo in december to these colors so i need somebody to highlight i guess i could do it it's not you know i i, I need to do this tomorrow actually so i'm going to switch my logo color to this for december i think that's pretty badassery but anyways guys let's go ahead and crack it open and check out who the hell sent this. I'm freaking giddy, man. I'm freaking hyped. Let's find out what the hell this is. Uh, before we open the letter, I do want to tell you guys what my list was. So, so on my list, guys, I said any Demon Finn Balor that Mattel has not made, and then I excluded SummerSlam 2018, which we ended up getting in the uh, in the Ultimate Edition. And then I also excluded NXT TakeOver The End, where he's, you know, the gray, white, and black demon, because I already have a custom of that, so I wouldn't want another custom of that. So I excluded those, and then I said, you know, any Demon that Mattel has has it made in the ripped up Finn Balor, you know, formula. And uh, so I guess we're going to find out what demon he went with. I'm super excited. I don't think we can go wrong with any of them. So I'm, I'm hyped to see. But let's go ahead and open up the note. Can I get it open? Two MDT from Paige. So Paige underscore customs, I do believe is his name. P-A-J. I don't ever know how to say it. I don't know if it's Paige or Paige, or Page, where it says, Hey, Trey, looks like I got you as my elf. I hope you like the Balor, because I had a lot of fun making it. So, bam, boozles, Brad. This dude is excellent. He does a lot of creative things, and I'll pop up some of his work on the screen as I'm talking before we get in there. Really, really talented guy. I think he's underrated AF. So I am ex super excited to add one of his figures to my collection. I think it's going to be excellent, man. I can't wait to see this thing. So let's go ahead and shut the hell up and crack open this Balor. All right, guys, here we go. Go ahead and taking him out. Oh my God, in heaven on earth and in heaven in the exact same time. Look at 
right, this Finn freaking football baller. Holy God in heaven, Brad. Dude, freaking nailed it. Look how realistic this shit looks. Holy Christ, guys. And time for the big reveal. Oh, God, I don't know if I'm ready for it. Are we ready for it, Brad? Oh, my God. God, <laughs> look at this freaking, look, look at this. This ain't decals, Brad. This is hand painted, brother. Hand painted eye on the back of the Demon Balor right there. Holy Christ. We are undeserving, bro. We are undeserving. Look at all the paint detail in here. I'm trying to get in there as much as I can. But oh my God, dude, you freaking nailed this. This is excellent. This is, I'm going to have to make room for this up on the shelf instead of the secondary shelf we got over there. We got to make room for it on the main shelf. The face details and the, and the everything, the Balor on the trunks, the red kick pads with the details on the shoes. He added the details in the shoes. You guys know I always add the details to the shoes of my Finn Balors. Even has the outsoles painted, Brad. Dude, you freaking nailed this, man. This is this is excellent. This is freaking excellent. Out of all the Demon Balors you could have done, and you choose this one, you even have the paint going down into the ab cracks like he had it. Oh, dude, you freaking killed this, dude. Everybody has to go follow him, man. Page Customs on Instagram. I'll definitely plug his name here so you guys can see it. What an excellent figure, dude. You cannot, you cannot deny. You cannot deny it, dude. You can't deny Look at it. Thank you so much, bro. This is excellent, man. This this is freaking excellent. Definitely one of my favorite battlers in the collection now. Shoot, I may be hitting you up for, for freaking, uh, freaking commissions, dude. I'm going to go over to you for all my commission battlers. I may just commission all the battlers that I'm missing from the collection over to you. This looks excellent, dude. You freaking killed this. So, everybody, please go follow Paige over on Instagram or Paj. I, I apologize for the name butcher again. But, dude, look how freaking slick that is. I'm definitely going to be posting this on Instagram later with better pictures, obviously, and better detail. Dude, I love how he did it. Let's do a side-by-side -side comparison of the actual demon, the way it looked, and then we'll do a detailed shot of the back right quick. I mean, dude, this is this is excellent work, man. You've definitely outdone yourself with this one, and you've made a lot of excellent work over on your page, so. But I think that is going to do it for today's video, guys. I, I am definitely going to go put this hoe up on the shelf. I'm going to do an excellent little photo shoot with this guy, post that up on Instagram, but this Finn Balor looks amazing, dude. You freaking can't it. I just can't get over it, dude. You freaking nailed it. But alright, guys, that is gonna do it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy. Epic unboxing from Ringside where you can use promo code MDTOYS to save 10%. Excellent, freaking just excellent custom from Paige over here with the Secret Santa custom figure. Like, my God. We got some epic stuff going on, guys. I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go work on Hell's Gate. Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE action figure videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MyDamnToys. Go follow Paige as well. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.